Hi, I'm Reagan Ravi. I'm a Ford and I'm from Omaha, Nebraska. What would you tell your freshman self? Advice or what to expect? Um, I would tell myself that this is going to be like the best, well, so far three years of your life and just be excited for what's to come. If I was asked if there's one player who's impacted in Nebraska soccer, I would say Reagan. I think Reagan's impact kind of goes beyond words. Reagan is rare. She is exceptional. I'd say we wouldn't be where we're at today without her. Reagan, coming from Millard West, didn't think we were going to get along. I always look up to her and how she plays. I don't think I'm ever going to be able to compare. But after these two years of, three years of being your teammate, um, two years of being your roommate, you are everything that is good. If anything, I've gotten to see what a leader truly looks like, even when she can't play. You can't even put into words how much heart she has for our team. Regan's a great soccer player, but she's an amazing human being. She personally has helped me bring my game to a whole new level. I just think as a person, but also as a player, as a leader, she's offered so many attributes and she honestly defines what Nebraska soccer is all about. She is going to be the first person to like congratulate you, but also like the person that like picks you up when maybe you're not having a good day. Being a player from Nebraska, she's been someone that I've always looked up to as like a playmaker. The way she holds herself, the way she talks, the way she demands, the way she leads. Regan is inspiring. She was the moment on our team. I don't think we'll be able to fill the hole that Reagan's gonna leave on the Nebraska soccer program. Reagan is just one of those players that you don't see come into a program every year. She was somebody that carried us through every single loss and every single time that we doubted ourselves. And she always pushes us to be the best. Every meeting that I've had with John, it's been about how Reagan's worked so hard, like someone to look up to. She is constantly bettering the program on and off the field. She's really just the epitome of what it means to be a role model and to lead by example. Uh, she's definitely attentive to your emotions and how you're feeling. I just think that that's just a legacy that she holds here. She is someone that when you need her, she's always there. She was probably looking up to the girls who were playing here at one point, but like now that's her whether she's on the field or not. Her impact on Nebraska soccer is very noticeable. She was a captain before she was given the name captain. Aside from being such an amazing person, she's always the first one to get an extra rep with you and the first one to congratulate you on a good play. And she cares a lot about the people who mean a lot to her. I would describe her as the heart of our culture. She is always looking out for everyone on the team. If we need like a shoulder to cry or not, if we need someone to kick us up the bone, that's always what Reagan's there for. I think one of the things that is the most special about Reagan is just like who she is as a person. Rehabbing my ACL has been one of the toughest and most difficult thing I've, things I've ever done in my life. But with Reagan, it's become more of an eye-opening and motivating and like 10 times easier experience than what it have, would have been if I was alone. She is strong-willed, fierce, um, and selfless. So yeah, she's just been a great example for me, like especially within my faith also. like She's been such a good example. She makes sure that you are not just an athlete, but you are way more than your sport. Everyone looks up to her, everyone trusts her. She has always been one of the most caring, kind people that I know and has made me feel so welcome from day one. I have got to live with her for the last two years, um, which has been awesome and I think just getting to know her and how she exists as a person has been really cool because what you get um, out in public is like who she genuinely is. She's what we all strive to be for every play, every practice, and every game. Reagan, who is from Omaha, Nebraska, which is very local, can achieve great things. And so I think it set an example that no matter where you come from, no matter what you thought soccer would lead you to, you can still achieve amazing things. As a player, I would say Reagan is just like, or Regan is an absolute beast. Reagan is literally a monster. Like that is the best way I can describe her as a player. If you're the Huskers in this situation, it's find the ball to Robbie. She's a game changer. Reagan Robbie is the hungriest and most starving player I've ever seen. Just like the type of player that she is, is really like an example of what it means to be a Nebraska player. And actually seeing the things that she does in practice where it's kind of mouth dropping sometimes. Defensively and in the attack, she's just crazy. I've never known a player like her. She's so hardworking and gritty. Like she's always in for like a good tackle. Um, and anytime she's on the ball, you know she's gonna, she's gonna be dangerous. You know, she's a machine in the attack. 
she's back on defense and she's just so inspiring to watch. I feel like it's so fun watching her on the field, but also like now getting to play with her for the last couple years, I've absolutely loved it. Reagan is one of the best players I've ever played with. Reagan Robbie, we mentioned her. She is back. This is huge for the Huskers. She's your talented player, Reagan Robbie is. Something that you're not used to seeing a freshman do going forward be across the Big Ten. Like, even in high school, I remember, like, I would, this is kind of embarrassing, I would, like, occasionally see her, like, even when she was playing at State, and I was like, oh my gosh, she's so good, like, I'm gonna get to play with her, that's so crazy. But it's Reagan Robbie who really created all of those opportunities on Thursday for Nebraska. Reagan was the most dangerous player on the wall. She's a badass. So aggressive, but just so physical, so good. She's just all around a great player. But she's got speed, she's got technical quickness. Sure, she was tormenting that left back for Purdue all day long on Thursday. Reagan is probably the one player on the Nebraska team that I would never want to go against. Six goals on the year that leads the team. She started every game. And that number six that you mentioned for Reagan Robbie, second in the Big Ten. So she is a prolific goal scorer that these central defenders, Olivia Hicks and Malika Days, have to watch out for. If she's taking on a player, like I know she's going to beat them. I trusted her anywhere on the field. Again with Robbie, what she did there, that is something you can't teach. Looking at her work ethic, like you can just tell she loves soccer. Um, when she's out on the field, she's always not only working her hardest, but like also just enjoying it. Got Reagan Robbie has absolutely tormented Purdue on Thursday and is one of the fastest players on this team. As a player, Reagan had a super, super high soccer IQ. And it shows the soccer intelligence and the high IQ of this sport for Reagan Robbie. She's been outstanding this season. She is a big threat, especially here at home. Characteristically, she's like what John would literally want in a Nebraska soccer player. She's probably the most hardworking player I've ever met. Number seven, Reagan Robbie is just covering so much ground. She just hunted down the ball and then it got cleared and she hunted it down again. Regan was like the most hardworking player on the field. She plays with joy and passion and it's something to just, that I always looked up to. So. Speed, agility, and all the quickness of the world. She's a player that when she goes 1v1, she's either gonna get by you or the ball's gonna go out for a throw. She's always gonna go at you. So I think, you know, if we can get the ball to Regan Robbie up top or get her in those wide positions, I think Nebraska can be successful. Having Reagan Robbie back made a huge part of the difference in the way that they were able to score that one goal. And Rascal was in a goal drought without Robbie. If you know anything about NCAA women's soccer, especially the Big Ten, you know Reagan Robbie can light it up at any moment. But Nebraska, once Robbie came back on the pitch, looked like a re energized, completely different team. I also think Reagan has impacted the Nebraska soccer program because of how she has dealt with injury and adversity in her career here. Robbie's leg hit the turf. Her knee hit the turf pretty pretty hard there. A lot of contact. Man, Reagan Robbie came down hard, and that's never good to see. Like here she's faced a lot of challenges um, along with her successes, and I think it's been really cool just to see her on her journey and how she's handled all the good and the bad. It's not easy coming back from injury. It's not easy not playing on like your last senior year. But the past few months I've been injured and obviously Reagan's been out with an ACL. Being injured is the worst thing for a D1 athlete and no one wants to go through it. Everyone just wants to be out there playing on the field. And she, this is her second ACL she's been through and I kind of looked up to her throughout the process and she always told me, see the good, but I feel like Reagan, someone that has had the best attitude and has shown how hard she's working when the cameras are off and that's something that only our team can see. And yeah, she just doesn't back down super easily and it's been really awesome just seeing her overcome so many challenges and be successful in a lot of different ways. Reagan and me tour our ACLs together um, about like five weeks apart from each other. So I've been spending every day, every week with her at least for four hours a day. My bad days to her bad days to our, both of our good days and going through the process and accomplishing baby tiny steps for each of us every day. It's been really cool to have that perspective. She is always a leader on and off the field. Even now, because she can't play right now, she's still like making an impact and I feel her support. Seeing Reagan the past few months in rehab and just grinding at it every single day has been super inspiring for not only myself but other injured players or just uh, the rest of the team in general. When players are coming off, she's giving them advice what they can do to be better. I think Reagan just 
no matter what her situation is, like she's always going to give it her all and like accept the challenge ahead of her, whether it's big or small. Because it shows like she has so many goals that she wants to reach as a player and a person, and she's grinding every day in rehab. The way she rehabs, um, if anything, it's taught me what it means to be a true leader. Reagan Robbie is developing into a fantastic, fantastic player as and, only a freshman. And that's her first career goal as a Husker, just 86 seconds here into the action. He's one of the most talented midfielders, not only for Nebraska, but really throughout the Big Ten. There's that nice little touch from Reagan Robbie. Reagan's impact on the Nebraska soccer program is basically monumental. See, I've never known a player like her. Is it something that you're not used to seeing a freshman do going forward with me across the Big Ten? She's a game changer. If you know anything about NCAA women's soccer, especially the Big Ten, you know Reagan Robbie can light it up at any moment. Reagan is just one of those players that you don't see coming to a program every year. She was a captain before she was given the name captain. That's just a legacy that she holds here. Anytime Reagan got on the ball, I knew it was going to be dangerous. She was the moment. It's kind of mouth dropping sometimes. For Nebraska, look out for number seven, Reagan Robbie. And there are people like like Katie, she's injured, Buzz is injured, like just had surgery, going to have surgery, like let's play for them. Like the people that can't play, like they would kill to be out there, so let's do it for them. Like play as a team, be there for each other. Reagan is literally a monster. She's a badass. There's Reagan Robbie, dangerous in the open field, gets by one defender, gets by two, find it. The pressure is good, however, early on for Nebraska. Robbie, oh! Top fans from Reagan Robbie! Are you serious? Notches her second goal on the kind of start that Walker was expecting from this Husker team, and that's what they made it to. I mean, as the speed begin around anyone, we just saw it there. Electric play from Reagan Robbie. Good spin move by Robbie. Robbie gonna use her speed to just fly around Knob. What a play from Robbie. And Robbie, a big touch over the defender on the left foot. Robbie's sliding forward, keeping on slide with his speed. And one back by Reagan Robbie. Look, we did Robbie into the penalty box. And the fact that Robbie was able to keep that ball live, she made it there. Robbie heads that one on, and it's in the back of the net. Swears the fire. Reagan Robbie still with it. A great touch by Robbie. And Reagan Robbie equalizes for the Huskers with just over 27 minutes left. Robbie goes the other way for Nebraska. The Huskers strike by Reagan Robbie. My goodness! Browns gets played over the top to Robbie. Robbie heads it all to the end and the Huskers have doubled their lead. Let me know if I'm wrong. Robbie's gonna have a chance. Here she goes. Oh, the early on for Nebraska. Robbie! There's that nice little bit. And that for Reagan Robbie! She was probably looking up to the girls who were playing here at one point, but like now that's her whether she's on the field or not. Someone I'll always strive to play like. Reagan's a great soccer player, but she's an amazing human being. You are everything that is good. It's been a pleasure sharing the pitch of you for these past three years. Being a player from Nebraska, she's been someone that I've always looked up to. I will be telling future generations of Husker women soccer players that come through here all about you. To play with you has been incredibly special. And I'm so happy that Nebraska brought us together. It was an honor to play with Reagan Robbie. The last thing I would like to say is um, thank you to Reagan's family for raising such an amazing teammate, um, friend, leader. It has been a pleasure just to be in your presence and to learn from you. I've just been really thankful to have her as someone I can lean on. Reagan, it's honestly been a pleasure sharing the pitch of you for these past three years. Reagan means so much to this team and to me. I've always just loved being around her. She's just so smiley. And I'm gutted that you're not on the pitch this season, but I hope you know how much of an impact you have on this team. You know, being able to look up to someone who's from Nebraska and who's just such an amazing leader. But with that, I think beyond that, she is just such a good example of what it means to be a good human and a good leader. I'm so happy Nebraska soccer has given me this amazing friendship with Reagan that I will cherish for the rest of my life. I love Reagan. We love Reagan. If I had to describe her as one color, it's yellow. Reagan is like the sunshine. She spreads to everyone around her and I just have loved getting to grow around her and 
it was an honor to play with Ray and Robbie. And I can't wait to watch you play in the NWSL once you get drafted. Even if you didn't have your senior season because you're a badass. To play with you has been incredibly special and I will always cherish those years. Um, I'm going to miss you a lot and I'm so happy that Nebraska brought us together. Oh, is it on? Yep, mm -hmm. whatever. Okay. Uh, well, okay, sorry. No, I you're good. Like... You're supposed to be serious, you know? Yeah. As we... You're good. Oh, this is so scary. Reagan is... Res... Re... Oh. <laughs> you're good. Okay, okay. Reagan is relent... <laughs> relentless. Okay. okay. Uh. I'd be scared if I... <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Okay. Anytime Reagan had the ball... What am I saying? <laughs> <laughs> Katie, you're good. okay. Reagan is a great soccer player. She got them saucy feet, and I. <laughs> Reagan has impacted. <laughs> wait, do I restart? No, you can. Okay, go. sorry. <laughs> so easy. Oh wait. Um, Reagan. Okay, wait. Sorry, what was the question again? Oh. Uh, sorry, Reagan. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's okay. Wait, am I going? Yep. Okay. Oh wait, I'll go. For the life. Okay. Say some. I know what I'm talking Okay. For the life. <laughs> Be a leader without um, bringing. On. on uh, it's okay. Off. Reagan is just one of those players that you don't see every year coming to a program. So. Reagan isn't. Oh, wait. Reagan's just one of those players that you don't see come into a program like this. <laughs> Reagan's just one of those players that you don't see coming every year. <laughs> Reagan's just one of those players that you don't see come into a program. <laughs> Reagan is just one of those players that you don't see coming to a program every year. She's different. <laughs>